a positive outlook. Is that still how the team is kind of looking at it? They're staying positive, and even though when you come off a game where yeah. the flight home probably wasn't a lot of fun from Columbus. Yeah, there, there's still a lot out there for us. You know, we're one and one in the Big Ten right now. A lot can happen, right? Um, it's in the Big Ten, um, and it's a really good conference. So you never know what's going to happen. And you know, if we just take it day by day and just try to improve and get better each week, you know, all our goals are still out there for us. And you know. Um, if the Big Ten title, I mean, it's still in reach, right? We just have to, we have to control what we control, and that's just coming in here every day and working and take it game by game. From the perspective of an offensive lineman, what does Y.A. Black do that kind of makes him so good? He is, one, he's six foot six and 340 pounds, so that makes it hard. Um, well, I just the run. I think the run game is what stands out to me the most. He is the hardest defensive tackle I've ever had to block in the, in the run game. I mean, one, he's so smart, and then he's just huge. He just understands everything, and you know, um, going against him now for three years, he's made me a lot better. But like, I don't think there's a better run game defensive tackle out there in the country, and I, I'll stand by that. Um, he's just so good at that and with his leverage and all these things like he's just so good with that I And mean, he's so loud. <laughs> I think you know, uh, he's yelling everything getting everybody lined up on the defensive line Like he's really <clears throat> the leader of that room uh, and he's done a great job with that and, You know, I just think he encourages the whole team not just the defensive line but the whole team. How is important or important is it for the veterans and the leaders that kind of uh, you know, speak up this week and you know Keep the train on the tracks, you know, keep everybody focused moving forward yeah, what's really cool about this group, and, and not just the leaders, but this team, that they know what they want to do, and I think they've seen what we can do, and they all want to go out there and win. So it's really not even coming from us, it's coming from the other guys on the team that just want to go out there every day and get better. Um, and I think that's just the coolest thing. It's like, we'll speak up when we have to. Like, we have great leadership on this team, but like, you see guys out there um, who are just working their butts off, and I think that's just so cool. And, it just continues to trickle down uh, from like the senior class to the low, sorry about that, to the lower, like lower uh, underclassmen. If we can continue to do that, have those younger guys working and trying to get better, like this team is just going to continue to grow. Offensively, uh, what Ohio State I think statistically is one of the best defenses in the country. You'll yeah. all year. Washington though, they're not giving up a lot of the yards either. Yeah. So that's kind of probably maybe a forgotten stat about them. I can, as a lineman uh, back home, is this kind of one of these challenges you you like to see again in front of you? Another stout defense that you guys you know really can work to improve this offense with? Yeah, I mean that's Big Ten football. That's what you live for, right? We played a tough conference and. To be able to go against good defenses like Ohio State and Washington and all these guys that we'll face, it definitely gives us a challenge. But that's an opportunity, especially for us up front, um, going against a good defensive line to you know prove ourselves and go out there um, and open up holes. And if we do that, you know it, it definitely gives us some encouragement and definitely high energy just to be able to move guys, which is our guy, which is our job, and it just makes it so much more fun to be able to move good defensive line around. I know the schedule's been the schedule, but a team from the Pacific Northwest is coming to play a conference game in Iowa City. Is that a, is that a weird thought to you? It, it is kind of weird. Um, somebody from way over there, I know. It, I know their stadium is actually really cool. I was kind of. I, I, I've always wanted to see all the other Big Ten schools and stadiums and whatnot. Um, and I know theirs is pretty cool. I, I googled it, but it'll definitely be interesting having them come here. You know, seeing. Kinnick. Um, I don't yeah, think a lot of people understand what it's like to play in Kinnick, so I think they'll be shocked when they get here. The importance of maybe establishing Caleb early. You guys maybe weren't able to do that against the Buckeyes, yep. but if you, it seems like when you guys can do that, it seems like it just kind of opens up a lot of stuff, options for you when you can establish him early. Yeah, I think just build momentum, right? Yeah. Um, when we block KJ, whether we're doing a good job or bad bad job, KJ is going to find a hole, um, and that's just so cool about him. And just seeing how much he's improved. Yeah, if we can establish him early, get him going, and build some momentum, like it definitely gives us some energy up front. And then we establish the run game. Boom! Now we're going to hit the deep ball. I mean, if we can just get him the ball, get running, um, it can definitely open up so many more things. You got your teammate Deontay Craig over there. What's it like going up against him in practice? <clears throat> Man, uh, I haven't. I only go up against him in like about two-minute drills and things like that when he moves from the end to the tackle, but it's fun. Um, we, we've been pretty close friends since freshman year. Um, he was on the fourth floor with me, but it's awesome, all those battles. Like, he gets me, I'll get him. Uh, it, it's a lot of fun, though, and I love when he comes inside because it's just a bunch of trash talk, and it's, it's pretty fun. I love him. What's he kind of like as a teammate then, having 